All right, everybody. We're here with a spooky experience for October. We're playing Gone Home on Xbox One. So it's 1995. I have come home from a trip abroad to Germany. This is my family home's porch. I am Caitlin. Okay. So it's my understanding that um, things aren't how I had left them. Um, and I have run through a few minutes of this um, in a couple of different sittings just to kind of see what I was getting into. But not very far at all. But we'll take a look here at this note. Katie, I'm sorry I can't be there to see you, but it is impossible. Please, please don't go digging around trying to find out where I am. I don't want anyone, previously mom and dad, to know. We'll see each other again someday. Don't be worried. I love you. Sam. So that clears that up. My sister has run away for reasons unknown. And we are going to try to figure this out, so... This game is very much about walk around, pick stuff up, look at stuff, examine things, etc. So, the house key is in here. And I have a backpack that I can check, as it was saying there. But very straightforward, very basic. We're in here now, so... still gets me. So, looks like we've just moved in here. Moving invoice. Pretty expensive moving bill. Dear Katie, so much has changed, even just since you've been away. We moved into this house. I'm in a new school. And my big sister being gone for a year doesn't make it any easier. It doesn't feel real. But I'm not gonna let it phase me. I used to tell you everything, and if I can't do it in person, because you're off gallivanting around who knows where, I'll tell it to this journal. Just like I was talking to you. Alright. So as we explore, um, and we find. Look at this baby's face! <laughs> Oh, man, now that is a baby. Bet money it's a dev's baby. Anyway, aside from this child, what I was saying was, as we, um, as we discover items and examine things, we're going to unlock some, some dialogue that's going to shed some light on the situation here. And from what I've noticed running through this previously... Um, just about every light you see, except for the sconces, uh, is interactable. Like this lamp over here. So again, light is definitely your friend, because it's not very well lit in the home, considering the circumstance. Um, but yeah, so check these drawers real quick. We have a note. Direction to work from new house. So it's an hour and ten minutes from here to Flintlock? Yeah, because we're in Arbor Hill, and it looks like whoever works there works in Flintlock. So that could be the sister, Sam. Okay, nothing in those. Alright, well, we may as well start with a sweep at the bottom floor. We've done the bathroom, done this corner over here. Uh, that hallway is eventful. We'll go down there later on in here. See? Interactable light. We've got a jacket with an ID tag. And this must be my mother. Senior conservationist. Okay. Board game. Okay. Just like that. And yeah, I'm gonna rack up the electricity bill. Whatever. Some stuff over here. Regional track and field. So this is one of my trophies. Is anything on it? Nope. Can't rotate it to the bottom. 
What is this? Made in Mexico? What is this? First place, Caitlin Green, Ryer. Okay. So, Star Child. Ah, these can open as well. I don't know why I'm crouching. I can do these standing up. Okay, well, let's turn on this lamp. Hmm. I don't know if the floor grate is in right now. It doesn't look like I can do anything with that. Dear Jan, it's so good to hear from you again. All all this new house business sounds like quite the adventure. Remember the little dorm room we shared freshman year? When we were miserable fantasizing about our dream homes? I always said I wanted a mansion. You said you just wanted a house in the woods. Look who got both. Somebody, somebody up there likes you. I could use some of that magic. Send me some, send me some lotto numbers. I'll play them seriously. But I shouldn't be complaining about this go. I shouldn't be complaining about this good old split. Oh, good old split level we've had since Bob got transferred to Winnipeg. Yo, shout out Canada. We just got new vinyl siding. Jealous yet? Let me know if let me know if you want to trade places. So how are the girls doing? Has Katie left on her big European adventure yet? Speaking of jealous, right back soon. I miss you. Oh, I miss you, Rumi. Carol. Okay. So I don't know who Jan is yet. I'm not sure if it's the mom or what. I'm guessing it's the mom because, like, whatever, right? These are not interactable. 1995 phone book. Can I get into this drawer? No, it's blocked by the lamp, so. Okay, what's in here? That is locked. Okay. I love this house. Oh, smoke alarm. Still active? I wonder if I can set that off. Alright, so we won't go upstairs right away. We'll go down here, so let's turn on this lamp. Check the, let's check the note first. Sam, Daniel from the old neighborhood called. He wants to come see the new house. Call him back. Mom, Daniel is a total weirdo. The only reason I ever hung out with him in the first place is that he had Nintendo when we were little. Oh, you're savage, lady. You're so savage. Mind you, I feel like I knew some people that did that with me as a kid. I don't know. Sam. Sam. Hello. Sam. Sam, where are you? Really? I need to talk to you. Please be there. What happened? Hi, Mom. Uh, so I got my ticket home from Europe. I get back on June 6th, but it's a really late flight because that was the cheapest, so it gets in at midnight. But don't worry, I'll get a shuttle from the airport so you don't have to pick me up. Like, really seriously, you don't have to. Okay, so, love you. See you soon. Bye. I want to know what the tears were about, because it's like I called my sister and was crying about something. Nothing. Just a busy signal. So that's Sam. Is that okay? That's Sam. That's me. Yeah, that's Katie. Okay. There's nothing over here, right? All right. So let's go down this way. Okay. Light switch. What's going on with that one down there? I don't know why I closed that door. Really, I should have left it open. Okay. Oh. Heaven to Betsy? Must be a band. Do you hear voices? What is that? I hear something. 
Welcome, new student. Okay, so this is her back. This is her back to school list for her first day of school. Okay. Oh my God, you are so lucky you finished high school before we moved into this house. So it's the first day of school, and there I am introducing myself to the class, and I say that I just moved into the house on Arbor Hill. All of a sudden, every kid in the room turns and just stares like I suddenly transformed into a mutant. I just stood there, pushing pretty hard for a rewind button. Because now maybe nobody knows my name, but they all know who I am. The Psycho House Girl. <sighs> Great. Okay. So it looks like this, this place has a history. Of what? I'm not sure. I'm guessing murder. Or ghosts. I found someone's office. I'm guessing this is my old man's office. Looks like he was writing some sort of a short story here. And something's blanked out at the top. Yeah, it's like some weird sci-fi sort of dealy short story. You can do better. What if JFK wasn't JFK? Oh god. Is my dad like a shitty, like, author? I guess he's like a crappy author, okay. Oh, there's something in here. Oh, maybe. No, 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 no. Maybe he just does that on the side. Looks like he writes tech for. going on. It looks like it looks like he does tech reviews full time, but he but he writes on the side. Nothing in here. Nothing in here. Nah. No. Nope. Okay. Anything over here? See what I mean about the lights, though? It's... I was expecting something a little spookier, but it's... It's atmospheric, that's for sure. So what's over here? There's something down there. The accidental... The accidental problem. See, so he works on short stories on the side. He's he's an author for like. It looks like I don't know what was it that deep like I guess in 1995 it would have been like a CD player or something, top of the line. The accidental pariah. Okay. Oh, of course. Of course. Vintage porno. Stranger under my roof. Looks like somebody was having a hard time dealing with his teenage daughters. What's this? Yeah, see, reviews. I write reviews, or <laughs> my, the character's dad writes reviews. Sounds like your job is kind of shitty. Oh, four, five, one. Remember that. Seeing anything up there? No. Okay. That looked like it could move. Oh. All right. Hmm. Okay. 
Enter combination. Well, there, that answers that. Four. Five. One. Ooh, it worked. Dear Mr. Missa, please find your original document and type to copy for your records. Okay. So, so oh, somebody's will and testament. Oh, Oscar Masson's will and testament. Okay, the following I shall hold true upon my passing. One, I declare that I am a lifelong resident of Boone County, that I am unmarried and have no children. I declare that I have no outstanding debts to my name, to any creditors, living or dead. I do hereby bequeath every item of value of which I may die possessed, including its dwelling and surrounding acres located at Arbor Hill, as well as any and all personal property and moneyed accounts to my nephew, Terence Greenbrier. That's my dad! In the event that said Terence Greenbrier Jr. should should predecease me, then and in such event the bequest to him shall fall, and the same is bequeathed to his children as ordered by age and competence as stewards of the estate. I subscribe my name to this will 13 day of August 1973. Signed, Oscar Masson. Okay. And there's the handwritten version of it. Alright. So, my dad inherited the house. We got forced to move here because he inherited it. So, like, whatever. There's nothing else in there. Okay. And is there anything to do with the painting? No? Okay. Um, alright. So, that's it for this room. TV? The Kelman County and Staria County. Residents are strongly urged to stay indoors and secure all the oh. doors. Flood conditions are expected at lower elevations. I'm stuck on something. Oh my god. Okay. This is a severe weather warning. The Northwest Weather Service reports high winds and torrential rain conditions affecting the following counties. Austin County, Boone County, Dawn County, Tekelma County, and Wistaria County. Residents are strongly urged to stay indoors and secure all windows and doors. Flood conditions are expected at lower elevations. Yeah, see, this is the thing from before, but the CD player is what it was. Yeah, CDs. Read the shipping label. David Waring, Hi-Fi Magazine. Okay. Can't turn it, I guess, because it's a one-sided label, so why would I be able to turn it? This there is, is a nothing. severe weather warning. The Northwest Weather Service reports high winds and torrential rain conditions affecting the following Can't counties. Austin County, Boone County, Dawn County. So the, the county sister was not making and friends, and then they bought her a self-help book. Parenting. You know that feeling where at the first moment you see someone, it's like they have a big gold star around them, and you have to get to know them? Well, there's this girl. I think she's a senior. She's usually dressed kind of punk, but sometimes I see her in this, like, army uniform, and she's always drawing in this notebook, looking so intense. I had no idea how I would ever, like, have an excuse to talk to her. Till I noticed she and her friends hang out and play Street Fighter at the 7-Eleven every day after school. Okay. That being said, I found a letter to Terry, the dad. It's hard for me to read, though. I don't know. Something about trying to find a publisher for the latest book or something. So he was struggling to get something published. The Accidental Savior. This is a severe weather warning. The Northwest weather okay, so that's another novel he wrote. 
the James Bond style novel. Okay. County, Austin County, well, Booth County, Dawn County, Tecumla County, and Wistaria County. Residents this closet. Yep. Stay indoors and secure all windows and doors. Anything? Flood conditions are expected at lower elevations. Kindergarten shit. Captain Allegra looked off at the ocean. It went on forever, or so it seemed. Someday she would find the edge and get to the paradise there. Then she heard a cannon fire. Boom! It was the black pirate ship. She yelled, I thought we lost them at the horse the island. The first mate said, Looks like you thought too soon. The black ship came up along the side. Captain Black himself came out onto the de what came out on the what came out on the deck of the black ship. Jesus, I'm in grade three. He yelled to Captain Allegra, "You're never gonna find the edge. There ain't no paradise, and your father were a liar." Captain Allegra. Captain Allegra yelled back. Then why do you keep following us, you imbecile? The first mate yelled out, We'll stop you, Captain Black. This we'll find the edge of the world, and you'll see North her West father West was West no West liar. West the battle kept going West until West Captain West Allegra's West ship West got away. West now west, West she said, Dawn and the ship West sailed West towards West the sunset. West so, West looks West like West one of the daughters is a, is, a, is a writer West like West Daddy. Are I'm gonna spook the shit out of myself by leaving all those open. Can I start a fire? Can I start a fire? There are no matches. Okay. What the hell happened in here? Is there anything in the pizza this box? Is a severe weather warning. No pizza! The Northwest Weather Service reports high winds and torrential rain conditions affecting the following counties. Austin County, Booth County, Dawn County, Tecumla County, Bratmobile, another one of the residents are strongly urged sisters to buttons. Secure all windows and doors. Flood conditions are expected at lower elevations. Okay, another book. Hauntings and Poltergeists. Find out the truth behind stories that were familiar even to our pagan ancestors. Okay. See, that leads me to believe that this is something more than just a rainstorm and people dipped. Alright, so we can go down this part of the hallway now. Coupons. What's this? Pamphlet. Um, okay, so that that's for the mother, I'm guessing, because she's into that shit. What's in here? What is that? Oh, oh it's like a bar. Okay. Party on, dudes. Nothing in there? Mm. No. Reproductive system worksheet six. Sam. Sam. The reproductive system? I've done the best I could. You keep from Oh, okay. Oh, I'm not gonna bother Can't get you off my mind. Okay, I'm guessing the teacher wasn't happy, so she probably wrote some fucked up shit. So I think the sister's like a troublemaker. Well, daddy, I didn't know you were. She's kinda like, uh, like the wild spirit. Okay, this is obnoxious. Shush. Holy. What is this? Dave Brubeck Quartet? Did get fucked up? Nah, just got pops. So there's nothing in here. What's in here? Another closet, probably. Yep. Samantha, please give this to your mother. 
Janice, thank you for having Danny over. Oh, okay, it's the, okay. When you live in one place your whole life, your next door neighbor is kind of like Nintendo your boy. default friend. And Daniel only got weirder over the years. So moving away has been a good excuse to, like, not see him anymore. But he did always have the good Nintendo games. Maybe I'll give him a call. So Sam is considering calling her. Okay. So she took a bunch of shit and then left? Because I was misunderstanding before, it seemed... So you know yeah. what they say about the it's best light journal. plans of mice and men? Yeah, it turns out it applies to Street Fighter 2. At least I worked up the courage to walk into the 7-Eleven and ask for a turn, but all that practice at home did not exactly translate in the wild. So after I was finished getting my butt kicked, I followed them outside while they smoked. And that was when she asked me if I was that psycho house girl. But then she said she's always really wanted to see the psycho house. Her name is Lonnie. She's coming over tomorrow. And that was the note that was in the bottom of that, uh, that cabinet. Alright, so I've moved upstairs now. Controlled burn scheduled. Okay, so what is going on? The radioactive material? All right. Weekly planner, but whose weekly planner is this? I guess that's the mother's. Bruce pedaled in ahead of personnel. So they transferred someone to her station in 94. But who? Flintlock. Okay, so the mother works in Flintlock, and she's supervising the project. Okay. I don't know if that has anything to do with the sister running away, but... For Sam. Love thing. Tab. Cherry. Throw. What the hell? Somebody made you a mixtape? It's weird hanging out with girls. Daniel was around ever since I was little, and other girls? I don't know. But being around Lonnie is, like, instantly just right. I gave her the grand Psycho House tour, and took my revenge on Super Nintendo. And it was like, I don't know, I finally found someone I feel normal around. I drove her home, and she gave me this tape, and said, You have got to listen to this. I haven't stopped playing it since. Okay. There was a letter here. To Hermit May Concern, I, Samantha Greenbrier, am 17 years old. Okay, yeah, so she's complaining about... Okay, yeah. She wants to go to the city with her friend, you can't stop me, blah blah blah, angsty teenager stuff. What is this? Chun Li moves. It's 
not a good mixtape. I'm not a fan of that kind of punk. Not, not even close. What is this? Sam, I think it's the creative writing track. It would be perfect for you. Hmm. What is, what is that? Did you hear that? So she's... She just seems like a rebellious, typical teenager. I don't know. Okay. Where the hell am I now? Bathroom? Okay. I have yet to see a spook yet. Oh my god, uh, no. Yeah. Lonnie brought her hair dye over today. She said, I need to fix these roots. Think you could help? Dying hair is weirdly intimate. I don't know if I've touched someone else's scalp before. That's pretty intimate, right? It felt intimate. We looked into the mirror together after, and... I expected her to say something about how it looked crappy, or good, or whatever. But that's when she said, You're so beautiful. And she was looking at me. Right in that moment, I wanted to say something. But I waited. And the moment was gone. Okay. Postcard I sent. Where the heck? Okay. What is that? Unknown dimension literature. Right. What is that? Look at this! happened in here, but it's definitely a little dicey. Another letter to Jan from Carol. Who is Rick? some dirty underwear. Another bathroom. Okay. Okay, so the, they're having trouble with their marriage. The mother's into a some kind of weird emotional relationship with a guy named Rick who's lending her books. Any other suspicious activity in here? What's in your medicine cabinet? Oh, the game didn't like that I opened that, and I don't know. Whoa. I don't know if it's picking up on the recording, but it's it's very, very loud thunder. This light was already on. Oh, look, a ghost game. Escape from Ghost Mansion. Is that really the only thing in here? A ghost board? Oh no. What? What the fuck? Hmm. 
Okay, so... I turned around for a second. What's this? Katie, Mom and Dad, we're going to make up the guest room for you to stay in over the summer, but you came home on such short notice that they weren't around to do it. You can use my room if you want. I won't be needing it anymore. Oh, my lord. So this is all the stuff that got that I brought back with me. There's a... What is this? Hey, Sam, you were asking what my... Something... Oh, ROTC ribbons. Okay. So what is she what is she doing? So Lonnie was in the military. August thirteenth, ninety four, a tall shadow in the upstairs hall when I rounded the corner. What? September third, nineteen ninety four. A faint voice coming from the bottom of the stairs. I said hello, did not investigate. Poured milk from cap... What does that say? Oh, poured milk from carton in the fridge. It was spoiled. Pretty sure I read the spirits can spoil milk. Seriously? Okay. The milk was just bought yesterday? Okay. Lonnie says she feels a pressure in the TV room. I suddenly begin to feel cold. We built a pillow for it. Lonnie and I employ the Ouija board as a medium. Disturbing messages are conveyed. Oh boy. It's a ghost named Oscar. Related. Okay. I. Mm, the writing on this last one. Possible ectoplasm. Okay, so there's something in the attic. What a ghost name Oscar, I guess. Okay, well, let's keep on moving through. What is this? Sam's dark room. Do not enter. Okay. Another note. This is Richard here. She's... What the fuck? So it's a ranger she works with and she's giving him a stellar review? She's fucking him for sure. There's so much distension and somebody was painting. And then they just, like, why, why start... What is this? Halloween show, don't forget your costume. Sometimes you just have to lie to mom and dad. Like when Lonnie asked me to see a band with her and stay over at her friend's place in the city after. That's a lie to mom and dad situation. But it was so worth it. The girls on stage were just so loud and real and awesome. And everybody was moving together like one huge tide of sound. Between two songs, Lonnie leaned over and said, How do you like your first show? I was so happy. I felt tears starting in my eyes. And then she up and hugged me. I think she could tell. There's a secret passageway somewhere. Interesting. So it's in mom and dad's room. So we were just there. We have to go back. This is mom and dad's room, I believe. Right? Then we have to go through... Is it the closet, it said? Open panel. this. 
Ghost Hunters, Sam and Lonnie. What the... Okay, so what did these guys figure out here? Three hidden compartments found. Library, upstairs, and the foyer. Okay. Is this going to mark them on my map now? Yes, it is. Okay, so we have something to chase. We have something to go after here, objective-wise. Uh, pardon me for the burp. Okay, so I was in here already. So, let's see. Where am I for the next one? I'm confused. Where did it say it was? Where am I here? In Dad's office. Where is it? Come on, is it... Is it one of these? It is. Okay. Progress. At Tot's brother's place after the show, there was only a futon to sleep on, so Lonnie and I shared it. The lights went out. I was turned toward her. My eyes started to adjust, and then I could see she was looking at me, too. In the dark, she smiled. My heart was beating so fast. I rolled over. I felt so, I don't know, nervous? After a minute, she put her arm around me and was so close and whispered in my ear, I really like you. I just nodded my head and I really hope she could tell. I really hope that she meant what I think she did. I felt like a shook up can of soda ever since. I hope we have the chance to talk before I explode. That's sweet, actually. I just want to know what the hell happened to this young romance. Okay, so let's... okay. Mm. Okay, but I'm confused. We have one of them. We got two, so it's just the, it's just this one here. Is it this? It is. What the fuck? Oscar. I have the attic key. Honey, whoa! The sunset light in this house is the saddest thing I've ever seen. It's hype cereal, though. I just want to sleep. When I'm in the attic, it almost feels like Lonnie could still be here. She's just downstairs. I'm just waiting to hear her pull down the hatch and come running up. Maybe I'll go up to the attic and wait. is about to happen, but I'm going to the attic as I have the key. Um, shit. I really wish there was a sprint button, but... Did you hear that? Or was it just me? I think this thing's... I think the game's just fucking with me now. Alright, let's see what's going on up here.
What the fuck? I thought that was a person for a minute. Holy shit. Sam, all I okay. Oh my god. What? Katie. I, I fell asleep in the attic. In Lonnie and my old spot. And I missed the first two calls. I just barely caught the third one before the machine got it. And it was Lonnie. On a payphone. She'd been on the bus to basic. And she said she couldn't... She couldn't think of anything but me and us, and that she couldn't go through with it, with the army and being a part and all of it. And so she got off the bus in Salem. She said, Sam, I want you to pack up everything you can and get in your car and come find me. And let's just drive until we find somewhere for us. And she asked me if I could do that. And I said, yes. Yes. Okay. Katie, I'm so sorry that I can't be there to see you in person, that I can't tell you all this myself. But I hope as you read this journal and you think back that you'll understand why I had to do what I did. And that you won't be sad, and you won't hate me, and you'll just know that I am where I need to be. I love you so much, Katie. I'll see you again, someday. Love, Sam. Did I just beat the game? I think I just beat the game. Wow, okay, so it's really just a narrative. It has absolutely nothing spooky to go along with it. Hmm. I was hoping it was going to have a little bit more spookness, but I guess no such, so no such luck. But still, all the same, that was actually really good for what it was. I mean, I thought it was pretty cool. But hey, you know, I guess we're going to have to find something else to scare the shit out of ourselves there guys but thanks for watching all the same hope you enjoyed gone home on xbox one as interesting as an experience as it was it was definitely something i enjoyed playing um and you know if anybody knows if i missed anything or if there's any more secrets let me know i'd like to to check them out if there are but thanks a lot for watching guys and i'll be back soon